you guys feel about the 10 street dancers that are performing on this live show? All I have to say is, squad! That's all we kept <laughs> chanting the entire time. They are fearless. They're coming in and they're hungry. You can see it when they hit that stage. Um, and it was a pleasure to work with them. Tommy, you, it totally seemed as if there's a lot of teamwork and love going on between all of them. Yeah, I, th I think for the most part, because they, they come from such different backgrounds dance-wise, and, and um, you know, in just in general in life, it was a really important thing for us to get them to come together and have that teamwork, and that's why we went with that military kind of themed thing. What better thing to bring them together? And, I, and, and as it started to live into their, into their bodies, then it started to live in their soul, and it started mm -hmm. to live in their heart, and before you know it, it was a It was truly a mission. Yeah, it, they, they came together really well. It sounds like, you know, the, you, they started off a little tame and then you guys just brought it out. Well, I mean, it's the fight. They, they all, as freestyle dancers, know how to fight when they get into the battle. But they, they know how to fight together. And that was where we had to get them on the same page. And their insecurities about maybe doing our choreography or the b-boys trying to fit in. Um, you know, we were positive, but we were strong because we only had a short amount of time to get it done, you know? Well, next week, so I think you think you can dance, is celebrating their 10-year anniversary. Are there any dancers or any performances over the past couple of years that stand out for the two of you? I mean, all of them. They all are so special in different ways. We're just excited to be able to say 10 years. I think we've been a part of almost every one of them, um, and it's a, a special place in our heart. Uh, Who knew 10 years ago that yeah. this show would go 12 seasons and have the mm -hmm. popularity that it did? So yeah. it's really good, great for our dance community. It's longer than some Hollywood marriages. I know. Yeah, exactly I mean, right. they can't keep exactly up with right. us, you know, but hey, we're we're plugging along. Hopefully they will. Well, is there any, any performances that you guys have choreographed over the past 10 years that stand out for you besides tonight? Absolutely. I mean, I think... I our think... ones that won the Emmy. I, we, in fact, we were talking about uh -huh. it earlier. It's, uh, uh, of course, Putting on the Ritz, a big group number that we did. Mm -hmm. And the one that Michelle Obama talked about, I which know. was uh, Ooh, Jasmine and Comfort. Yeah, Run the World. Um, Alex Robert, and Twitch. Alex and Twitch, another Absolutely. big one, yeah. And the scars, Robert pointed that out tonight, uh -huh. was, a, was another one. And I don't know, and we have a lot. Bleeding Love, I think Bleeding Love for us was a, a kind of like our introduction to So You Think You Can Dance, and, and so that'll always be special in, in Bleeding Love and, 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 and Nowhere. And Nowhere. Because, and it was a different style for hip hop, and, and people, you know, it was a really important thing for us to show people that hip hop can be seen in a different way. Ten years, you guys have seen an evolution yeah. in dance and the way that dance is viewed on television. I mean, what do you guys think about all that? I feel like I'm very proud because I feel like before street was always just street, but now it's street and art and it's taken more seriously, you know? So I think that for us, that's kind of was our mission back then to show a little more artistry to the style. We can get down, we can get dirty, we can mess with the best of them, but it's also artistic as well. But beside the, even outside of just the hip hop genre, it, it's dance in general and mm -hmm. we're just excited that people are still watching it. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's, it's, it's uh, I think, so you think you dance had a big, big, a big part or the biggest part in making dance so popular but other you know the other shows too dancing with the stars and america's best dance crew and all the dance shows have made it possible for people to for the dancers to show people that they are entertainers and now it's going on tours you know we, we just directed derek and julianne huff's tour which is sold out everywhere dancing with the stars tour selling out everywhere the so you think you dance tour sells out everywhere there's shows on on the vegas strip now that are just dancing and not involving, you know, singers, which we love too. But at the same time, it's nice for our art. Congratulations! You guys have not aged in ten years. Oh. <laughs> oh, Definitely gaining you. some weight. <laughs>